Hi, my name is Gabrielle Correa. I'm here with Hop News and the chairman of the elementary school in Hopkinton. This is Mike Shepard. Thank you, Gabrielle. Um, the, uh, again, I'm Mike Shepard. I'm on the elementary school building committee. And the committee was formed by the Board of Selectmen about a year and a half ago. It consists of 13 members. And our role is to develop a proposed solution to the operational and educational constraints of the set of school. The Santa School, as you may know, was built in 1928. It's over 85 years old. It served a lot of the citizens of Hopkins very well and still does. Um, what we're looking for is a, a school that um, will meet the needs of the current population. Um, the, uh, we, we're looking at a lot of proposals um, where there's still more to come. We've currently um, got an owner's project manager on board who is Compass Management. And uh, we're partnering with the, the MSBA, the Massachusetts School Building Authority. Uh, in partnering with them, they will reimburse up to 40% of the cost of the school, which is a substantial sum. Uh, the time frame is, is very long. Um, it, it, they do everything by the numbers. Uh, we're currently interviewing uh, the, for the design team, that's the architect. Once we get the architect on board, we're going to have a public charrette uh, on a Saturday, uh, sometime in November, where the public will come, we can talk about the, the different options and what they think. Um, we're also uh, setting this up so that perhaps by fall town meeting next year, we could get a vote from the citizens of Hopkinton uh, up or down on our proposed solution. Uh, and it's generally anticipated this school will be ready for occupancy probably by uh, the beginning of the year of 2017. So I understand the two options are renovating the school or rebuilding? Yes. Um, the school, as you know, is, is somewhat dated. It's had two additions, one 30 years ago and one 30 years before that. Um, what we're looking at is renovating the existing facility, and that's where the design team comes in and the charrette and all the ups and downs and pros and cons of that, or build an entirely new facility um, on, on land that the town currently owns or land that we can acquire. Um, so all the pros and cons will be weighed, and uh, what you do is you present these, these options to the MSBA and they help you choose what's the best one economically, uh, what's the best one operationally, what's the best one educationally. And, uh, but no stone will be left unturned in this investigation. And you have another date for a meeting? Yes, the, the building committee meets pretty much monthly. The next meeting is the 30th of this month, and it's at HCAM up at, I believe it's 77 Main Street. Mm -hmm. um, we, we're trying to make everything public, everything transparent. That's another reason why i got to thank you folks for letting me speak here. We're trying to get the word out. I don't want anyone to stand up at town meeting when we go for this vote and say, this is the first I've heard about it. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Right. You're very welcome. Thank you. <laughs>